Good afternoon, this is Garrett with Dave Barber Gas Conversion Vans, and today we're going to be taking a look at a 2019 Chevrolet Express conversion built by the Explorer Van Company based out of Warsaw, Indiana. This is a high roof, nine passenger example with the Vista Bay windows in the high roof. Limited SE package with the chrome trim and 20 inch alloy wheels. On the front bumper here you have LED fog lights and an Explorer front step plate that you can fold down and step onto to use to clean the windshield if needed. This limited SE package does include the power running boards that fold down for you when you open the door, like so. Makes for easy entry and exit. All your power controls on the door here, like your windows, mirrors, and locks. Headlight and dome light controls there on the dash, and your Odometer control buttons are right here, so all your van info and trip info will be there with those buttons. Nice dark gray with the uh, dark gray inserts on the leather. You have a nice light gray accent in the seat with light gray stitching. Taking a look at the odometer, we have just a touch under 73,000 miles on this 2019. You do have eight-way power adjustable seats with heat and power lumbar support on the armrest here. You also have a cooler in your center console with two cup holders and a wireless phone charger in the back there. Your factory glove box and center stack with three cup holders. All your factory controls and outlets are here below the radio, so you've got your traction control switch, your passenger airbag lockout, your OnStar controls, your collision warning and lane keep assists, and, like I said, your outlets on the end here. Factory GM upfit radio, front HVAC controls, rear mood lighting and rear HVAC controls up at the top here, as well as a dome light on both sides. It's a nice blue color. You don't see this blue color on a lot of these conversion vans. It's a little bit more unique than, say, silver birch or black. Come around to the back here. We've got our backup sensors in the rear bumper, as well as a rear-mounted backup camera by the plate holder. And you do have a hitch receiver with a 7 and 4 pin connection. Open up the back of the van, you'll see we have the pleated shades on these rear windows. Every rear window behind the two front seats, so the driver and passenger seat, has these shades. It is also equipped with a three-piece power sofa bed that is operated with the switch over here on the right. To fold the bed back up into a bench seat, just press and hold this switch, and it'll operate for you. If you need to move the whole bench forward or backwards, you can do so with this additional switch right here. Move the whole unit forward or backwards. You have a little compartment for your vacuum as well as an outlet, your roadside toolkit back here as well. And with these nine passenger vans, you do need to have the sofa bed as far back as you can have it in order to fold it down all the way, as well as the seats in front of it. They do need to be as far forward as they can go for you to be able to fold the sofa bed all the way down. That only applies to the nine passenger vans. Coming around to the passenger side, we do have a power running board on this side as well that covers all three doors. See it fold down for you like so. This van is equipped with the removable swivel seats that come standard on these Explorer Expresses. To remove the seat from the van, all you have to do is pull this lever up and out and rock the seat backwards out of its base and pop it out. If you'd like to rotate it 360 degrees in any direction, locking, facing either the rear or the front, you can pull this lever here and rotate the seat in your desired direction like so. So if you need some more leg room for the sofa bed in the rear, you can flip those seats around, or if you just would like to face the other passengers in the back, you can do so as well. See in the center console here, we have our aforementioned wireless phone charger up top there, a DVD and Blu-ray player, and game console hookup down here. 
You do have wireless headphones included, as well as a flat screen TV with its own independent speaker system. Vista Bay windows in the top instead of the storage compartments. You do have additional mood lighting in the ceiling, as well as a power sunroof out in the back there. And some additional storage in the rear by the HVAC vents. All around a very clean, well cared for 2019. Carpets and leather are all in good shape, just as well as the paint. This may be the van you're looking for if you need a low mile, late model van. If this van or any of our other vans may interest you, go ahead and give us a call. Thank you.